Satellite Survival Analysis. If you want to read the our paper which we published, you can go through the Scopus profile of Prof. Young Jolie or me. sector, we study the analysis of incomplete data caused by censoring in even time survival data. We specify bivariate data, one is survival data and the other is the censoring syndicator. Sox professional hazards model is widely used for the analysis of survival data. This model is interesting due to its semi parametric nature, where the baseline hazard assumes a non parametric model, but treatment effects are modeled parametrically. Variety models with a non-parametric baseline hazard extend proportional hazards model by allowing random effects in hazards and have been widely adapted for the analysis of surviving data. By using the X likelihood theory, we can show the Poisson XGLM algorithms can be used to fit these models. Following by Ha, Li, and Song in 2011 showed how the X likelihood can be used to fit semi parametric models with random effect. Suppose the data consists of right sensors time to events or observations from key subjects or clusters. And we have variables TIG, CIG, YIG, UI, and N. TIG is the survival time for jets of observations of the eight subjects. CIG is the corresponding sensoring time. YIG, the minimum value, TIG, CIG is the observer random variable, ui in the observable variety of the each subject, and n, sigma i, and i is the total sample size. Here, we can consider a censoring indicator delta ig, such that delta ig want if the ig less than or equals cig, and for zero otherwise. Then, we have bivariate observed data, yig and delta ig. Variety models by given UI the conditional hazard functions of TIG is T is of the form lambda IG T with conditions UI and lambda zero T exponential XIG transpose beta UI where lambda zero dot is an unspecific non parametric baseline hazard function and B and B beta one until beta P Transpose is a factor of predication parameters for the fixed covariates XIG. Here, the term XIG transpose beta doesn't include an intercept term because of identity. Intercept in terms is in lambda 0 t. Assume that the varieties ui are iid random variables with the variety parameter lambda. Here, lambda is used for the hazard function. Gamma variety models assume gamma variety with expectations UI 1 and the variance UI alpha. By log normal variety models, assumes log normal variety VI, log UI follows the normal distributions with mean 0 and variance alpha. By multi component variety models, we have the form X beta plus Z power 1, V power 1 plus until z power key and v power key where x here is the n cross p model matrix z power r with the r start from 1 until k are the n cross key r model matrix corresponding to the key r cross 1 varieties by v power r and v power r1 and v power 2 are independent for r1 not same r2 note that z power r is a matrix having indicator values such that ZST power R is 1. If the observation S is a member of subject T in the earth variety component and 0 for the otherwise. Competing risk models. Suppose there are key clusters of subjects and each cluster has any observations. For jets observations in the eighth cluster, let TIGK denote time to type key event. K 
start from 1 until big K and big C IG denotes independence censoring time. Competing risk models assumes the people die due to competing risks or disease. Then the observed event time will be YIG, the minimum value of TIG1, TIG2 until TIGK, CIG, and define the event indicators delta IGK with I, YIG equals to TI IGK. By including delta IGK is 1 if the type K event and 0 for otherwise. The third point, the cost specific hazard functions conditioning on the log variety VI is VI1 until VIK for the jet observations in the cluster I who fell from cause K is lambda IGK T with conditions VI lambda 0 K T exponential X1 IG power transpose BK plus VIK where lambda 0 kt is the arm specified baseline hazard functions for the event type k. We have bk here, bk1 until bkp transpose is a p cross 1 factor of fixed parameters for event type k and fixed covariates xig and vik are the random event for the type k event in cluster i. Regarding the protein models, if someone dies because of some other disease, his or her, the time is the treat as censored. However, if you treat the date to the other disease as censored, a Zev bias may occur. Thus, we need competing risk models. Consider a case of big K is 2, the even time from cause 1 and 2 would follow cause specific proportional hazard models. Therefore, we have 2 lambda here, first lambda, lambda IG1, and lambda IG2. Lambda IG1 T with conditions VI is Lambda 0 1 T Expo exponential X IG transpose beta 1 plus VI1. At the same time, Lambda IG2 T with conditions VI is Lambda 0 2 T exponential X IG transpose beta 2 plus VI2, where the V here might be correlated. In line with this, in the traditional cost specific analysis, Patients with cost 2 are treated as censored. Then, a potential correlation between VI1 and VI2 is ignored. Which represents by these figures. The N3 for lambda IG1 for type 1 event and lambda IG2 for type 2 event.